All right, same day, new video. I guess what I'm gonna do is I am going to wash my truck here at the car wash. To hopefully get this stuff to stick better. I almost thought it was raining, but then I remembered I was sitting next to the door. Money. I had to take my hard-earned soda drinking money to clean my truck. Water feels nice. Dog. I don't know how I'm gonna do this one-handed though. So I am going to do a video of watching the truck. So I hope everyone enjoys. If not, my video. Bad. Out. And away we go. And here the bath anyways. I'm going to do this another four minutes for a good soap coming on. It's a good bath anyways. Bones getting wet. Hair.
just like that. But my truck is clean. I'm gonna give it the old 65 mile an hour blow dry. Somebody was trying to rush me too. And I was getting in my truck and I was like, don't rush me. I'm doing vlogs. Wow, oh, man, I might be taking the truck tonight. Looks like rain. It's a little kind of silly. Look, passing somebody with a phone on a selfie stick. But I don't care. Nah, you know what? I'll take my bike one more time. I'll take the bike one more time. It's supposed to be good until tomorrow. Hopefully it works. Gotta give this truck the old 65 mile an hour. <laughs> Never mind, no comment. But yeah, it's just what it is. I'm going to try it again with a clean truck, more cleaner truck, I should say, and see what happens when I get home. Yeah. Yeah, it's almost noon, so I'll leave it like that, see what it does. But it might work now since I cleaned it. Might not. We'll uh we'll see what happens. I probably shouldn't really be putting this up by my face like this. Because I could probably get pulled over. So I will Get back to it when I get to, when I get the truck home. So hold on, everyone, and enjoy it. All right, so now I'm back home. Got the truck home from the car wash. I got one more bolt. I'm going to try this with. I took it to the car wash, as you saw. Soaked it, sprayed it, rinsed it, all that good stuff. Now I have until I get home with work to have this stuff cure. So that's about eight out. Well, if I do it now, 11-11, so about 12 hours, it's got to sit. Clean vehicle, rinsed off. So let's see what happens. We'll go from there. There's my victim. Here's the flex seal. I wonder if I can do this through the camera. Probably not. Now maybe it's not just working like this. I don't know. I just fell. Maybe it just doesn't work like this. Put that right there. Maybe I'm just doing it wrong. I don't know. We'll put it right. I'll put it right there. Give it a little more time. it's even sliding when I remove it. <clears throat> I 
All right, so I will leave it like that. I'll do a time check. Oh, there's my keys. Do a time check. Twelve nineteen. Okay. So twelve o'clock. When I put it on, I'm going to see what it looks like by the time I get home. There's no clouds, except for over there. But I'm going in this direction, in a way to work, and I'm gonna let it sit there. See what happens. Now that I'm letting that cure over time, let it harden, see if it works this time. I think the other, I think the next time I'm gonna do is just I'm gonna see if I can take the, door, the panel off the door and pop it that way. So right now, I don't think I've showed any of this on my videos, but I am gonna be going to my lovely summer living quarters which is my camper I don't know if I've shown anyone this yet on YouTube because I know I know I, I go over here in the summertime because you know it's warmer now And I have made the mistake of trying to stay over here in the winter time. And that was a epic fail. And it still still looks all the same when I left it last last year. Not too bad of a thing. I mean you got a bed, obviously. Everyone knows how campers work. Right? You would assume slide out a slide out to give me more room my other spare room in case somebody wants to stay I don't mind the tools I've been working on it my bathroom in here Tiny, tiny shower, of course you know, it's a tiny home. Tiny summer, sp spring, summer home. Got my table here, got where TV can go. My green screen for my games, whenever I get that set back up over here. My nice little table that I have not moved stuff since last year. So, there, there's my Spring, the summertime home. Oop, wait a minute. Got the reel in my awning. Or not awning. Slide out. Extension, you know. You know what I'm talking about, guys. It's not rocket science how these things how these things work. The only bad thing is that I gotta do here is that stupid me. I thought the water was drained out in the winter time before I went over. Ran all the water out, ran the lines, thinking, you know, water's out, okay. Not once did I think to buy, to buy the antifreeze stuff and run it through. I should have, but I didn't. I kicked myself for do, not doing it like that. So now I gotta figure out where I have my leaks. I have no water up by the kitchen area. And no water. Well, that's about it. No water by the kitchen area, but I have water, some water in the bathroom part. So now I gotta tear, now I gotta either fix, fix that myself 
or spend how much an hour they're going to charge to fix this. Or somebody knows how to fix water lines in a camper, I'll look them up. They'll probably charge an arm and a leg, but like I said before, it is what it is. Stupid me, I should have done that. But, eh, it's cozy. My own little getaway. Make my own gaming videos if I do some driving stuff on the four wheeler and I can be by myself here but other than that ain't bad for what I paid for it some people say I probably paid too much some people say I shouldn't have gotten it but you know just to get out of the house just to get out of my parents house for the summer spring and summer because everyone needs to get out of their house. Well, I, I can't say everyone needs to get out of the house, but, you know. Some people are ashamed to say they live with their parents. Because they're so many years old. Me, I look at it as, hey, I got a roof over my head. Food. That's how it is. Now, why isn't that going? Can't get it locked. Oh, wrong key. I mean, I probably should start moving some stuff over to it, but you know, there it is. All right, so I am going to leave my other video here. Let's see, if you want this hat, because I'm pretty sure everyone watches 3D machines. I will put my, his link down below in the description. And there's no way I am a, what is it, affiliated? No. Sponsored by him. Sponsored by Flex Glue or Flex Seal person. My own money. There's my sister's Jeep, by the way. Hey, Dalton, you want a Jeep? <laughs> I'll sell you my sister's Jeep. Other than that, hope everyone enjoyed my video of part two of my flex glue uh, repair of pulling out that dent. So until next time, enjoy the wonderful weather whenever we get it, wherever you're at. Stay safe and I don't know. See you in the next one. Okay. So. I've let it sit for 24 hours. I just gotta find my pliers. Here's my pliers. I've let it sit for 24 hours. Man, do I look burnt. I'm gonna see if it's stuck. This is my last attempt for this. If it doesn't work, flex glue, flex glue, your product is useless. So here we go. All right. So this is what I have. It feels somewhat hard. That hard. And let's do the finger test first. Really? Useless. It's useless. Use flex glue is useless. Right. So useless. I don't know if it was just the way I was trying to use it. Maybe it wasn't supposed to do it that way. I don't know. Two two attempts that I did. Useless. Useless. I'll try I'll try something else with the flex glue and make a video of it. But until then, never trust what the TV says. They gotta be really good actors to sell this stuff. So until then, it's Pony Joe signing off.